Moxie Call. How's everybody doing this morning? Everybody doing good? You know, I did a, I did, um, I decided to test myself last night. And before I went to bed, I decided that I wasn't going to be like I normally am, very prepared for my next day. I decided I was going to try to live the way a lot of my clients live. I want to feel exactly what is it that their challenges are that they're dealing with from the second they get up. So I decided to say, huh, no, don't worry about setting up your FaceTime live for tomorrow morning. You'll do that tomorrow morning. Nah, don't worry about doing. And I put off some of the things that I normally do. And then I went to bed and then I woke up this morning and I think I felt like a lot of you do. Woe's me. Today's, oh, I even had tears coming out of my eyes. Can you believe it? I had tears coming out of my eyes because my mindset was so impacted with noise that just didn't serve me well. Huh. So what did I do? I had to get up. I had to take a shower. I had to look at my reflection. I had to make myself feel better. I had to rise from all of the noise, just like you can. So if you are at that place where there's a lot of that commotion and that noise that's going on in your head, and guys, it's not serving you. Is it serving you in any way? Is it serving you? If you're answering no, then guess what? Get rid of it. So here's the deal. Get in the shower. If you still have the attitude and you're near your shower, get back in the shower. <laughs> Cleanse it off of you. Turn on the music. Turn on good music. Turn on music that makes you go moxie, okay? Turn it on because you got to start dancing. This is how I went ahead and I got rid of all the noise ooh, that was in my head this morning because I decided... I decided last night when I went to bed that I wasn't going to go like I normally do. Huh, interesting. And I woke up with all of this noise and it was all, it was too heavy. I didn't like it. It wasn't serving me. And I got in the shower. I cleansed off. And here I am, guys. I am back to having a fabulous day, controlling what I can control, changing what I can change, and being the best that I could be for me, because then I could shine for everybody else. And that's what you have in your control today. Today is the day that you're going to go ahead and you're going to turn those controls, those noise, off, right? Some people have trouble meditating. I'm one of them. I cannot close my very awake eyes now. I cannot close my eyes and meditate. Doesn't work for me. But what I can do is I can find a vision point, right? A focus point. And I could find that spot that gives me tranquility, tranquility. It could be a tree. It could be a leaf. It could be a little spot on the wall. So for some of you that have trouble meditating and getting rid of all this noise in your head, go into a daydream state of mind. How about that? Allow yourself permission. You just can't stay there. Go into a, a dream, you know, that daydream set, but just for a little bit. If you have to set an alarm so you don't stay there, set an alarm Give yourself two minutes. Two minutes is a long time. Set your alarm for two minutes and then just go right there. Breathe. Figure out what you can control, what you can't control. Release. Maybe you need to call me. Maybe it's our time to be speaking with one another. Contact me, guys. That's what I'm all about, okay? Take a deep breath again. You see, you have to understand that whatever this noise is that has taken occupancy in your mind, in your brain, in your head, oh, McGillicuddy, it is your worst resident. Oh, it's your nightmare. I want to do an eviction. Are you ready to do an eviction with me? Huh? Oh, are you ready? Evict, 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 evict. We're going to evict all that noise, all that clutter that doesn't make any sense in our minds. We're going to take care of what we have to. We're going to start leaving a more organized life for us so we could enjoy our tomorrows because each of us deserve it. Some of you are writing some stuff to me, and if I'm not wearing these guys, I can't see what you're... Okay, I should look, right? 
Okay, let's see. Good morning, Nancy. Uh, duh. Back on as the inspiration and effective Wendy. Yes, I am. Good morning. Mary, oh my goodness, I cannot see all of you. <laughs> That's my, that is my techno technology difficulties. But know that I absolutely adore each and every one of you. And change is only a mindset away. It's only a pocket of emotion away, okay? So let's, today, let's make that change. Let's make that difference. Let's go ahead and vacate all that noise that's in our mind and become so much more, so much more than we could ever imagine. Because why? Because we can. We are the landlords of our minds and our brains. And I'm giving the sign right now. The eviction notice is on and you don't have 24 hours to get out of my head. You have to move out now. <sighs> I could feel it. I could feel them moving. I could feel the furniture moving in my head. Can you feel it? Can you feel your couches moving? And wherever they were residing, they were like ants in your head, right? Oh, there they go. There they go. <laughs> See ya and never come back again. I just got rid of all that crap, all that shit noise that was in my mind. You want to do it with me right now before we leave? Huh? Do you want to? Let's do it. Right now, it's time to evict all the bad shit that's in your head. Ready? Okay, look at yourself. Mm, evict. Because now what you've done is you've given yourself your reflection to know that you are the landlord. You are the owner of your own real estate in your mind. Evict. 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 And all of a sudden you could feel. Close your eyes. Take a deep breath. Oh, wait. Blow it out. Think about all your noise before we close off this morning. If you meditate... If you cannot meditate, visual point, stop what you're doing. Think of all the noise, all the clutter in your head of what you cannot, cannot control. Take another deep breath in, blow it out slowly. The next deep breath is where you are going to literally open up all the doors in your head and all of that bad noise is now going to be leaving your head. Are you guys ready to open up all your windows? The next breath is us opening the windows in our minds and after that we're going to push out all the bad thoughts. The windows are opening in our heads, in our minds. You could kind of feel the lift off your shoulders. Raise your hands slowly. Raise them. Raise them. Stretch it. Open your windows. Open your windows. One more time. Let's open the windows, okay? One more time. Breathe in. With your hands going up. With a little bit of resistance, like if you were holding weights. Open up your windows in your mind, your mind. Your windows are open with your arms up in the air. Stretch, 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 because you're going to need it with all your might to get those bad noises out of your head and bring your arms down, kind of like a yoga position, go figure. And here we go, guys. We're evicting. Ready? Evict, evict. One. Two, it's like lifting up a, a thousand pound elephant, right? One, two. <laughs> I feel fabulous. Oh, stretch and move like if you were dancing because you've just freed yourself from all the bad noise in your mind. So everybody, <gasps> be the inner strength of you and evict everything that bothers you. Mwah, 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 mwah. Happy Moxie Day.